Hi, welcome back to the channel. Mind control weapons to control the minds of the Uyghurs in the Xinjiang region. On December the 16th, 2021, the US added 30 plus more companies to its so-called blacklist, um, which means that um, American investors, uh, companies can't, can't buy or invest into those Chinese companies. It also means they have restrictions on what can be supplied technologically from the US to those companies. And they've cited in their uh, sort of um, statement that it's either due to that these companies are dealing with the Chinese military or that they are citing um, alleged human rights abuses against the Uyghurs in Xinjiang. Now, it seems that most of these allegations are completely false. Um, and I actually would have more respect for the USA if they came out and said, look, okay, we've got these technology companies, um, we can't compete with them. And because of that, we don't want to get ahead too far. So we're gonna sort of sanction them. Now, whether their actions are in contravention of WTO rules or not, I don't know. I would have to look at that and maybe that's a video for another time. But, you know, they use this um, playbook that they've used time and time again of these um, alleged human rights abuses, which I don't believe is the real reason they have these sanctions. But what's kind of funny about this is the Telegraph, the, the newspaper, the Telegraph, came out with a headline that the uh, Chinese authorities are developing mind control um, weapons um, to control the minds of the Uyghur people in China. And really, to me, that's just laughable, you know. Um, you can see many uh, videos on YouTube that, that show how um, Uyghurs, you know, have a reasonably nice life here in China. But what's kind of funny is that actually, I think the um, West uh, are already uh, delving into mind control weapons of their to control their population. It's called Western mainstream media. You know, you look at the amount of um, lies they make up about China and push that through um, Western media to their population. Um, of which a lot of them believe that, you know, they, they've, they've got their population believing there's a genocide in Xinjiang, which, you know, they have no, there's just no evidence whatsoever of that at all. Um, so, and, and, and then you look at that, you know, not too long ago, the US passed a bill um, authorizing an extra $300 million a year to basically create false narratives on China to make it look bad, to, to you know, bash it. So <laughs> I already think um, the, the US and the West already have this mind control weapon. Anyway, you let me know what you think in the comments down below. As I say, don't just read the headlines, look at the facts, do your own research. But as always, for now, take care.